One shingles, one poisoning, and a golf ball on the head. Have you? Evening, Charlie. Make sure the milk was fresh. The stuff's cheese. You know, Charlie, you got a very angry streak. What's your sign? Oh, no. Oh, seriously? Taurus. Oh, the ball. A bad day. You're at war with Mars. Great. Where's the rest of my army? Stop crying. <laughs> you don't fool me. More lies. You're crying for him. No! <laughs> Back and he's the best. We've come a long way, that's for sure. Yeah. Full circle, I reckon. I've just been banished from resource. <laughs> a life in cubicles for me. Well, 30 years is not a bad run, is it? Had to end sometime. Hi, Charlie. I'm so sorry I can't be with you to celebrate your 30 years. It's such a wonderful achievement. And you're such a wonderful man. Mr. Fairhead, we've seen a lot of things over the years, me and you. Too many things, you could say. But that's what happens, I guess, when you've been around as long as we have, old fossils that we are. But that experience, that consistency of care, that body of knowledge, well, that means something. So here's to another 30 years. The year the M25 was completed. 1986! The year that Mike Tyson became the youngest heavyweight champion in history! 1986. The year a fresh faced, bouncy haired nurse entered Holby City Hospital, A. &E. Oh. Hey, Daddy Hope! No flesh, unfortunately, it's not on the goal. So, very good. Years. Professional, passionate and fair. That's what I think of when I hear your name, Charlie Fairhead. And when they called me to say you're celebrating 30 years, I thought, wow, it's got to be more like 50. You look old, mate, to be honest. On this, we are cranking this one up to 11 mil, mate. Oh. 11! That's oh. all right. The veteran of the blues. Hang on, where's Charlie? Who's Charlie? Is the groom the reason we're all here? By the way, I still haven't had my one phone call. Charlie, what is that? He's not lost. Just doesn't want to be found. And I don't blame him. He's been a alone for a long time. A person gets used to that. took you so long. I don't know what you're talking about. It's only been 30 years. Are you... <laughs> Charlie's always there. 
ever since my first day. Have a problem? Go to Charlie. Need professional advice? See Charlie. Tea and sympathy. <laughs> Charlie. <laughs> oh, I know what it sounds like, but um, we're just friends. At least we're not together. It's just... Charlie's special. <laughs> Duffy. Hello. Oh. Uh, can, you, can you hear me? My name's Duffy. Oh, you're freezing cold. Oh, so cold. How long have you been? It's all right. It's all right. I'm a nurse. I'm a nurse. I'm a nurse. I'm a nurse. Let's get into the ambulance, out to this chill, then get it out to those clothes, do a full set of obs, and we take it from there. Yeah. Yeah. OK, Duffy. Duffy, my darling. What's my name? Sorry. Don't know. It's the dementia. She's not good on names. Oh, well, just keep talking to her, and we'll be there as soon as possible. Yeah. I almost died. Well, almost is one of the most beautiful words I've ever heard right now. Did you come out looking for me? Yeah. Yeah, I needed the exercise. John, I'm sorry. It's all right. So you're telling me my wife's going to die? Tell me. I'm so sorry. This isn't your fault. She's almost gone, isn't she? She's almost gone. After the diagnosis, I thought a few more years, please. Than the TIA. One more year. Please, give us six months. And that turned into begging for a few weeks. A few more good days. Funny old thing, time, isn't it? One minute you've got so much of it, you don't know what to do with it. And the next...
I do love you, Charlie Fairhead. Would you do me the honor of making me Mrs. Fairhead? We wasted a lot of time, you and me. But we're here together. Exactly how it was supposed to be. You are the love of my life. And it's all right now. I'll be all right. You can go now, sweetheart. You can go. Thank you, everyone. It means a lot.